The main concern with electric vehicles is their overall range, but when they're being used within cities, they truly come into their own. With shorter distances to cover at slower speeds and restricted parking spaces, electric microcars in particular are becoming the best choice for millions of people in urban environments. In this video, we'll be taking a look at 10 unique electric microcars for urban mobility and show how exciting a market it's become. Before we begin, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to Most Extreme and click the bell icon for notifications. Now, let's get started. Zev Yo-Yo Designed by Italian-based manufacturer Zev, the Yo-Yo was originally revealed to the world in 2018, with plans for it to enter production by 2020 following a crowdfunding campaign. Weighing just three quarters of a tonne, the electric microcar is just over eight feet long, five feet wide and a little more than five feet tall, meaning it's compact and nimble enough to drive and park in even the most restrictive of urban environments. The electric motor is capable of providing a continuous output of 7.5 kilowatts, with bursts of up to 22 kilowatts possible for 30 seconds, and this gives the vehicle a top speed of 44 miles per hour. It's fitted with a lithium-ion phosphate battery that can be charged at home or with public charging points and offers a range of up to 93 miles. It's therefore not suitable for use on highways, but with a starting price of less than $10,000, this could well represent the future of urban travel. Currently, the focus is on the European market because the cities there have tighter regulations on emissions and far fewer parking spaces, but the company hopes to expand worldwide within a few years. Toyota C Plus Pod the Toyota Motor Corporation has always seen itself as being at the forefront of technological innovation and arguably convinced the world that hybrid vehicles were feasible with the design of the Prius. The next revolutionary design is called the C Plus Pod and it's specifically designed to be classified in the Kej car size category in Japan so it benefits from a series of tax, registration and other advantages. Measuring just 8 feet long, 4 feet wide and 5 feet tall, it's powered by a permanent magnet electric motor with a lithium-ion battery that's located beneath the floor to spread the weight. The two-seater vehicle has a range of 93 miles on one charge with a top speed of 37 miles per hour, which is more than enough for urban spaces. Currently, the company is targeting corporate customers with the C Plus Pod, but the plan is to make them a core part of the Toyota Share car sharing service and be available for outright purchase by customers in 2022. Tazari Zero Originally revealed in 2009, the Zero, which is produced by the Italian manufacturer Tazari, is a lightweight electric vehicle that's proved to be ideal for city use. Measuring almost 9.5 feet long, 5 feet wide and 4.5 feet tall, it's powered by a lithium-ion phosphate battery that, in its most economical mode, gives it a range of 87 miles. With a top speed of 64 miles per hour, it can take 9 hours to fully charge the battery, but by using 3-phase superfast power supply, it can be charged to 80% in just 50 minutes. Even with the heavy battery packs, the two-seater car weighs just over half a tonne and features all the basic amenities, such as a radio and electric windows and mirrors that you'd expect. And in many countries, it's not only eligible for tax grants, but is exempt from most congestion or emission charges too. Smart EQ 42 the German-based smart automotive manufacturer has established itself as the market leader for microcars designed for urban environments, and the latest model, the 4.2 electric drive, incorporates battery technology into the already familiar form. The two-seater vehicles, which are available in either a two- or three-door style, were first tested in London in 2007, and in the time since, a number of improvements have been made, so the current model for sale, which was released in 2019, is actually the fourth generation of the design. Fitted with a 17.6 kilowatt hour battery, it has a range of up to 90 miles and a top speed of 78 miles per hour. The biggest changes though have been with the battery technology that was developed with assistance from Tesla and it takes just a couple of hours to achieve a full charge, with an 80% fast charge possible within half an hour. Aixam City Based in France since it was incorporated in 1983, Aixam has always focused on the development of microcars, specifically for use in cities, and after being acquired by Polaris in 2013, they are now committed to only producing fully electric vehicles. The leading design is called the Aixam City, which is a two-seater vehicle powered by a 51.4 volt lithium-ion battery. Measuring just 9 feet long, 5 feet wide and 6 feet tall, it weighs less than half a tonne, has a top speed of 28 miles per hour and a maximum range of 70 miles. What's particularly unique about the Aixam City is that the company offers them as license-free vehicles too, where you can essentially hire them for use without having to worry about the extra costs involved with ownership. Citycars Me 
Revealed in 2019, British company City Cars designed the Mi in response to increasing restrictions in the country's cities surrounding vehicle emissions. Available in either a passenger car, box van or pickup truck style, the 72-volt electric motor gives the vehicle a top speed of 48.5 miles per hour, and the 10kWh battery means it has a maximum range of 93 miles. Weighing just over half a tonne, the Mi is just over 7 feet long and 4 feet wide, but still manages to fit two spacious seats in the cabin. The designers have purposefully chosen these dimensions to make this a real space saver and claim that it means it needs less than half the space to park than a traditional car. And if parked at 90 degrees to the curb, you can actually fit three of these vehicles into one space. Despite not being allowed on motorways, the Mi is competitively priced to be seen as a second vehicle for urban use, with the base model available from around $10,000. Mitsubishi i Miev EV First announced by Mitsubishi in 2009, the i Miev electric vehicle is a five-door hatchback designed for corporate and family use in urban environments. Measuring 11 feet long, just under 5 feet wide and 5 and a quarter feet tall, it has a 47 kilowatt permanent magnet motor and is fitted with a 16 kilowatt hour lithium iron battery. This combines to give it a range of up to 100 miles in perfect conditions, with a top speed of 60 to 70 miles per hour depending on its configuration. While the overall range may not on paper look too impressive, the company used batteries that can be recharged much quicker than other models. It's possible to reach 80% capacity in 15 minutes for example, and you can charge 25% in just 5 minutes. This, along with the fact that the iMiev has an increased passenger or storage capacity in comparison to other electric microcars, makes it a seriously attractive option for regular users. Citroen Ami French manufacturer Citroen has entered the electric microcar market with an ingenious design called the Ami that in France can be driven by anyone from the age of 14. At just 8 feet long, 4.5 feet wide and boasting a turning diameter of just 23.5 feet, the Ami is a two-seater vehicle with a passenger sitting behind the driver. Featuring a lithium-ion battery that can be fully charged in three hours, the electric motor generates 8 horsepower, so the car has a top speed of 28 miles per hour and a range of 43 miles. But the thing that's most surprising is just how cheap an option it is. Costing less than $10,000 to own outright, but also available to hire for four years at a price of just $30 per month, Citroen is making zero emission urban driving a possibility for everyone. Polaris Gem E2 Polaris has become one of the most creative companies within the electric vehicle space, and while they offer a range of longer distance vehicles, their truly groundbreaking work has been with short distance cars. The current model, the Gem E2, is a two-seater car that's just 8.5 feet long, 4.5 feet wide and 6 feet tall, with a weight of just over half a tonne. It has a 48 volt induction electric motor which produces 6.7 horsepower and with its top speed of 25 miles per hour it has a maximum range of 90 miles on a single charge. Furthermore, the company has made the Gem E2 highly customizable with a wide choice of different battery types, colors and seat styles. With prices starting at around $10,000, Polaris has created an easily affordable and practical microcar that's perfectly suited to urban or community spaces, while being more comfortable and feature-packed than you'd expect from similar vehicles from competitors. Lexus LFSA In 2015, Lexus displayed a new electric microcar concept at the Geneva Motor Show, and while it's not yet in production, it shows just where the company thinks the design of this type of vehicle will go in the coming years. At 11 feet long, 5.5 feet wide and 4.5 feet tall, it's just large enough to give space for four passengers. Several design features have been incorporated to maximise available room in the cabin, including the way that the driver's seat is fixed in place and the steering wheel and pedals are, instead, adjusted for their comfort. With a hologram-style infotainment system and a wide-angle heads-up display, the LFSA looks make it truly feel like a futuristic vehicle, while retaining its zero emissions credentials. Highly manoeuvrable and lightweight, the electric version will have a top speed of 40 miles per hour with a range of up to 100 miles, but as battery technology improves, the company expects this to significantly increase. There are already so many electric microcars available, and based on the progress that's been made, it's a market that'll only increase in size in the coming years. Do you think they're practical yet? And which of these ones could you see yourself driving? Make sure to let us know in the comment section below and remember to subscribe to Most Extreme to hear about our latest videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.